Okay, hey YouTube, SJ Superior Pythons here, and in this video, I'm just going to be explaining how I built or made my tracks for the glass for this 4x2x2 four by two by two that I'm currently building right now. Alright, so first of all, I took um, 3 quarter inch, just pine, 3 quarter inch pine uh, that I got from my school, and cut it 2 inches wide because... Um, Split two by four on its side is one and a half inches, and then I'm using half inch plywood in the front, so it's flush right here on both sides. And do the same at the top, as you can see. So yeah, um, what I did was I ran, I measured a quarter inch in, and then I made my first cut. And the saw with a table saw, I uh, just ran that through with the uh, blade set on three quarter inches, so it only go or not three quarter, um, <clears throat> three eighths inch. So the blade only went in here three eighths of an inch. It didn't go all the way through. And then I did another quarter inch in, and then did my second cut because I still I still needed room in between to put my, uh, my showcase lock for my glass. <clears throat> and I just uh, ran that through. I did the same thing with the top. And uh, I don't know if I can get those pieces. Right here. Um, this is going to go right here. No, well, it's going to go in here. But I still got to cut the size. So I forgot to take into account of the top track. I only took into account of the bottom part. But, um,. It's going to go here so <clears throat> that the glass will overlap it. There's a smaller piece right here. When this, when this side of the glass comes over, it's going to overlap it so the uh, monitor can't get his claws in there and, you know, open up the glass. I mean, there's still going to be a, a showcase lock on it, but I just, I just want the extra safe. And that, that too, so no bugs can get out. <clears throat> um, and then on this side, it's going to be, I think I'm going to do right here. So when I do open this side, I'm going to pull it over and it's going to stop on this. But it's still enough room for the front pane of glass to pass by and get stopped by this border, half inch border right here. So yeah, um, there's still a little bit of sanding I have to do. Right here, it's kind of a bump and there's a knot in the wood. So, I'll have to do that. But, other than that, that's, that's how I made my tracks. But, my glass is just glass from Home, uh, not Home Depot, Lowe's. The eighth inch glass. Uh, it's, it's on my Timor monitor cage right now. But I plan on uh, getting rid of them pretty soon. Uh, I'm going to trade them for something more handleable. For the time being, he's in the 6x3x3. Three three. Uh, he'll go in here because uh, I'm using way too much electricity just for that giant cage and that small animal. So I'm just going to go in here for the time being before I can get rid of him and get the new animal that I want. I think I might trade him for a Chinese water dragon and some cash. And he'll go in the 6x3x3 by three by three up here flipped on its side. So yeah, I'm gonna probably urethane it on Saturday. Put him in here. But anyway, getting off topic now, so glass. Uh, it's I got twenty-four by thirty-six inch glass panes downstairs on the six by three by three with the Timor monitor, like I said. <clears throat> So I'm just going to take it to a glass shop because I don't really want to screw up the glass and have to buy more. You know, it's not expensive. It's like $5 for one of those sheets or something like that. I don't know. 5 10 15 something like that. So I'm just going to take it to a glass shop, get it cut so um, it's not completely touching the, com the inside. Just pretend this is the top so it's not completely touching the bottom of this. At the top, rather. <clears throat> Down deep in there. 
so it's not like scraping up against the top. So it's gonna be, a, I'm gonna cut an eighth inch short. You still kind of lift it up a little bit, and it'll have a little bit of play in case there are some raised spots in here. <clears throat> and yeah, I just left like an inch and a half, I guess, inch and a half, maybe inch and a quarter. Just so I can run my screws, it split a little bit here. Probably because I drilled it in the knot. Um, this this one wasn't as bad. But, uh, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve screws in there, and then one, two, three, four, five, six screws in the top one. Just I want the bottom to be more secure. It's not going anywhere. And there's this one. Um. I don't know, I should get out of focus, but yeah guys, it's pretty much my tracks, and I'll have the glass in pretty soon after I polyurethane, I'm going to let it off gas for two or three weeks before I put my monitor in, so yeah, see you guys.